Jordan here. Welcome back to Bite Camp's online learning series. I'm super excited today to introduce you to a program that we love at Bite Camp, uh, and that program is called Scratch. Scratch is a Logic Bricks coding program, and we love it for a few reasons. The first, it's super easy to use. Second, once you learn how to use it, you can create some really cool things. And then third, Scratch is free for you to use. Uh, and that's super awesome. You can download it at home. I'm gonna jump on the computer and show you how to use it. So included in the description below, there's a link to Scratch's homepage. From here, I can start creating right away. So if I click Start Creating, um, it will start loading. Here we are in Scratch's online program and I can start creating right away, as I said. But right now, Nothing will be saved if I exit my browser uh, because I don't have an account. I could download this onto my computer and then re-upload it the next time I wanted uh, to work on the project. However, that's an extra step that we don't wanna deal with. Um, so what I can do is I can join Scratch by clicking join Scratch in the corner here um, and I can create an online account. So it'll ask for a username, password, a few other questions. Before you create an account, make sure you check with your parents. But if I sign in here, as you can see, my username's up here. That means that I'm logged in. Uh, and if I wanted to save my work, I could create a name for my project here and I'm gonna say file, save now. And it's saving my project as we see here. Now, once it's saved, it will say project saved, and I can click on this little file folder and all of my projects that I've created so far will show up. If I wanna open that again, I just go see inside and it will bring me back to that project. The best thing about Scratch is you can download a desktop version that doesn't require an internet connection. Uh, so we've included the link to download that below. When you click on that link in our description, you get to this page and it tells the requirements for downloading the Scratch app. All you have to do is select which system you're using. So for example, I'm using Windows and then follow the instructions that pop up below. Now I have my Scratch desktop version. And if I were to create a project in here, all I have to do to save my work and keep it safe is file save to my computer and I want to open it later, file, load from my computer, go to the file that I want to load it from. There's Jordan's super cool project. And there we are. So that's how you can get Scratch at home. Uh, definitely check out our next video, which will give you some tips to get started in Scratch. Uh, and then definitely remember to subscribe because we are going to be releasing those cool tutorials on how to create Bite Camp's version of a mini Mario adventure game. And you definitely don't want to miss out on that. See you later, guys. Mm -hmm.